Well, it is hard to believe that we are just days away from September, and that means Labor Day is just around the corner. And if you're looking for some Labor Day fun to end the summer, well, the city of St. Joseph may have exactly what you are looking for. So joining us this morning live to talk more about the next week's Labor Day events is Danielle, the events and operations manager of St. Joseph today. Good morning. Thank you for joining us. Good morning. Thanks for having me. Of course. So tell us what's going on in St. Joseph for Labor Day. Definitely. We have a jam packed Labor Day weekend. As you said, I can't believe it's already September. Here we go. <laughs> right. Launching ourselves right into fall. But in St. Joe, we've got three big major events happening in downtown. We've got our St. Joe Farmers Market from nine to five with extended hours on Saturday, September 4th. Lake Bluff Artisan Fair is happening from 10 to 5 in Lake Bluff Park as well. It's on both sides of the farmer's market. And then wrapping up our weekend on Sunday, September 5th, we've got our Antiques on the Bluff from 10 to 5. So Antiques on the Bluff and Artisan Fair feature both over 50 vendors. You'll find a wide variety of items at the Artisan Fair with handcrafted goods. And then, of course, antiques um, and collectibles and vintage items at Antiques on the Bluff. That's awesome. And you guys, uh, you mentioned that you'll be having these concerts at the event. Can you tell us about some of the artists that will be performing? Are they local? Yeah. So we actually have, um, there's two municipal band concerts that'll be held on Sunday, September 5th and Monday, September 6th. So that's our city municipal band. Um, there's lots of live music, however, happening all around downtown um, and in Broda, Stevensville, Benton Harbor, some of the breweries, wineries and restaurants. We've got um, free tote bags also, I forgot to mention, for the St. Joe Farmer's Market for the first 250 guests. So lots of stuff happening um, in and around St. Joseph all weekend long. <laughs> That sounds awesome. Is there anything else that people should know before heading to St. Joe for Labor Day weekend? Def yeah, definitely. So you can head on over to stjoeday.com for those list of events. Um, lots of businesses are uh, doing anniversaries and specials and, and things like that, too. So lots of really fun things. The Tri-State Regatta is coming in. So if you wake up early with us on Saturday and Sunday, you'll be able to see those boats come into St. Joe on Saturday and then leave again um, for their under the race on Sunday. <laughs> awesome. Danielle, thank you so much for joining us this morning. We appreciate it. Enjoy your Labor Day weekend. Thanks. You as well. <laughs>